battery you can charge with phone charger. Uh, yeah, yes. Um, for anyone who hasn't seen these, these are these are really cool. They also have them in USB-C flavors now. This restaurant has their salt and pepper in pill form. You know, I saw from a prop guy that I follow on YouTube that you can actually buy these and they use them on, on sets for fake pills and things like that. Just the capsule bits. So it's honestly kind of cool. This phone with a warning. Use at your own risk. Okay, wait, what, what does it go to? What does it do? Does it do more than a phone? Does it, does it phone more than most phones? This ominous fortune. Be cautious while walking in darkness alone. Uh, that That's not ominous. That's just good advice. I guess I lived in New York for a while. Uh, th uh Generally good advice though. Little mummy figurine we found deep inside a cave. Put it, put it back. Put it back. Actually, it looks injected molded, so it's probably not that old. So the curse probably isn't that powerful, but it's still cursed. My sushi restaurant delivers the food by steam train. By steam train. <gasps> oh my God. I really like trains. Oh my God, that's so cute. Oh, I don't even like sushi and I'd go. Oh, that's amazing. I just, I just. Oh. Sodium chloride crystals found in an expired beef concentrate bottle. Oh, I know that's a fingertip. I know it's not that big, but still, that's pretty cool. Now we just want like a pure salt crystal. I don't know why I want one. I just want, I desire the cube. In Switzerland, we have fondue cheese vending machines in our villages. In Switzerland, you are happy. <laughs> Man, like, this is something that Florida should have. A and Switzerland over here is, like, hot cheese on tap? Yeah, sure, here you go, just just tap your card. That's, that's insane. My new door latch cost one cent. Uh, okay. Home Depot does this sometimes. Oh, penny prices at Home Depot are items that were on clearance longer than a time limit that they set that end up getting written off and disposed of. The penny price change is automatic. If you luck into one, it means they miss removing it from the shelves when the clearance time limit expires. You technically aren't supposed to ever be able to buy those. That's inflation for you. I remember when it was free. This elevator has an 8.5 floor. Uh, if the elevator has two doors, that could mean that it's either in between two buildings that were eventually joined together or it's some type of freight floor. These heavy duty reusable plastic dishes with ants painted on them. No, absolutely not. I hate it. Get out, get out, burn that. I hate ants. A narwhal appeared on my pancake. That's adorable. That's like a really, that's like a perfectly clear narwhal and everything. That's, there's no mistaking that. This isn't the squint and you might see Jesus Christ in your grilled cheese. That's, that's an actual narwhal. Narwhal is my god now. Wow, picking a religion was really easy. Ice patterns on my car in the morning. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I love ice. It's just so much fun. I don't like when it's cold. It's just pretty to look at. It's one of, it's like, everything sucks, but at least this is pretty. The way these jets crossed paths. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, if you ever want to have like a mild heart attack, look up a flight tracker. I think there's one called 24H or something like that. Um, and just zoom out. You just have a constant heart attack. It's, it's wonderful. I love it. Found a fully intact peanut butter cup in my peanut butter cup ice cream. This is, this is going to sound like a really stupid question. Um, did you not expect to find a, I, I've been to the Ben and Jerry's factory. It's fantastic. I, from what I could tell, they just dump stuff in. So like, yes, yeah, some of it gets mixed, but like a lot of it does like uh, toppings are huge in those. All these lights look white in real life, but when I take a picture, some look green. Infrared. Actually, no, it's not infrared. Firefighting planes flying over parents' house to pick up water from the lake. I've seen stuff like this. This is incredible. The pilots that do this are insane and wonderful people. Grocery store near me has a pineapple cutting machine. Freshly cut pineapple in 15 seconds. This this just seems dangerous. Like my grocery store just got a bread slicer and I think it's the coolest thing ever and I'm still scared of it. And it's broken. Is it a pineapple cutting machine? If it can't cut pineapples, it is not. My company sent me a birthday card that you can plant in soil to grow flowers. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I really like that. That makes me happy. Bunch of tiny text. I'm not reading that. You get the idea. You stick the card in the ground, you get some flowers. Found my pogs and slammers. I never had these. Sheltered, sheltered childhood. Crazy parents. But I do like that these have become like tiny little snapshot albums of pop culture. The way I folded this quilt perfectly shows the face of this astral polar bear. Astral polar bear is a fantastic band name if anybody hasn't used it yet. And it's just faded enough that you can kind of like set it somewhere and wait to see if somebody notices a face? That's perfect.
perfect. I love it. A duck egg I found in my pond this morning. I like that it has its own cellular antenna. If it gets warm, uh, drop it because I don't think the FCC is regulating these. That poor duck, imagine her sitting on that. Freak Sweet Potato resembles a finger. Freak Sweet Potato is also a fantastic indie band name. And that does, that That would be, a man, you, you lower the angle of that and you put it in black and white and make it slightly off center, especially with the microwave in the background. Album cover, done. New ATM asks to insert card horizontally instead of vertically. Oh, oh, it, oh, it, oh, it just, it's, it's, it's a wide boy. It just, just swallows the whole card. Found a couple of time capsules from 2011 while cleaning up my attic. Oh my God, it's, that's adorable. I absolutely love this, this is fantastic. My vet has a pheromone diffuser that relaxes dogs at appointments. Wait, really? That's, that's a thing? That's a thing that not every vet knows about? Can, can we like, is there some sort of call every vet button? Drinking glass decapitated by my dishwasher. Uh, yeah, there, there's a, there's a bunch of spinny parts in your dishwasher on the top, bottom, and sometimes the middle. You get the really adventurous ones. And, uh, yeah, yeah they'll, they'll whack stuff right off. My neighbor's rock spells it. It. It's, oh, it does. Oh, I don't like that. No, put that away. The end of my ponytail was frozen after my run this morning. Oh, it was, yeah. The way you put that is like, I went for a run this morning and then I froze my ponytail. Yeah, I hate wearing hats, even when it's snowing outside. And if you're outside in freezing rain, you'll get that kind of like shell on top of your hair, especially if you have long hair. Was foggy on my way to school and the sun reflected off the building and you could see the sun rays. God rays, God rays, God rays. I love God rays. I have so many pictures of God rays. Giant sunscreen dispenser outside of CVS near me. Wait, really? Oh, that's good. Man, that, that needs to be more places. We found an electric blanket in the attic from 1957. I'm sorry, did you mean you found a fire starter? That's terrifying. I kind of want to see inside of it, but I also want you to just like immediately recycle it or donate it to a museum. Thunderstorm seen from far. Yeah. Yeah. When I was little, I wanted to be a storm chaser before I knew I wouldn't be able to drive. I still sort of got into lightning photography. I love storms. I've seen so many like wild storms look so crazy and it's just, you, they're just pretty every single time. I love storms. I have a heart shaped vein. Yeah, kind of. I was like, I have some veins on my hand. Do they sort of, no, they just, why do they look angular? Am I real? This box of seashells I found. A pretty? pretty I, I should preface that I'm from Florida and very biased and like I've seen literally millions of seashells. But all of these look very nice. I'm more interested about the box. It's like, it's just somebody's, are they going to miss it? <laughs> this partially digested worm fell out of the sky onto my car window. I'm not going to put this under mildly interesting. I'm going to put this under mildly gross. No, no, put that back. Yes, just chuck it up. This urinal has an SD card slot. Uh, okay. You didn't also specify that there was a visible computer here? Um, because the implications of your first statement were, were, questionable at best. Pardon me while I load the entirety of Shrek onto an SD card. Shrekking while peeing. You should, you should, sorry, probably see a doctor about that. Yogurt soda. Absolutely not. Another great band name. Absolutely not. No, that's gross. Oh my God. Yogurt's gross on a good day. My newborn son was born with a heart shaped thumb. Heart shaped. Oh, like a, like a whole heart on made out of thumb. That's pretty cool. Just, wait, are there two? Does he have two? I had to look at my ha hand to remember the name thumbnail. Wow, I'm great at words. That's really cool. And I'm going to skip right past all of the Alabama jokes because it's a newborn. I, I'm, I, I, I have limits, okay? My granddaughter's gym still has the Soviet flag up. Look, you know, when it's behind the trophies and everything like that. <laughs> Just, it's a lot of work to get up there. It's, it just doesn't matter. Our gym got some uncutted spaghetti. Sp sp spaghettini. Blah. Oh, so it goes around rollers. Oh, that's really cool. I wonder how the. I wonder how long spaghetti you can make. Like, at Barilla should make prank boxes where it's just one spaghetti. Like it's just one, but it's a box full of spaghetti. I would pay good money for that. I would also probably eat it because I really love like really long linguini. So yeah. No, gimme. My curtain stopper is shaped like. Okay. Oh, I thought it was gonna be uh, MK's logos for a second. No, 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 it's just, okay. It's just reminding you. Everything's gonna be okay. Just shut the window and don't look outside. This baby crab found on grocery store scallops. That was a sentence that I did, like, you ever have one of the sentences that just goes in a completely opposite direction? Yeah, that's one of them. Baby crab. Very cute. Two dragonflies chilling in a hot tub. Five, I'm sorry. Uh, having snacks on half a hot dog uh, floating in a lake tied to a string. Okay, the indie bands from earlier, here's your lyrics. I'm I'm disappointed that the image is as accurate as you claimed it to be. And I'm still trying to untie my brain noodles from 
that sentence alone. This vending machine of hot drinks includes a strong chocolate option. What's the strong chocolate? Is it like super dark or super caffeinated? It's salty hot chocolate with vanilla. Aww. It's not bad. No, that sounds good, actually. Salty, I'm out. Salt in your coffee actually takes out quite a bit of bitterness, and it doesn't take much. Edit. I feel I should add that I do not salt my coffee. I would try that. I think I've tried that. I've tried butter in my coffee, because the streamer that actually got me into content creation way, way, way many years ago, like, swore up and down that butter in your coffee was the best thing ever. I don't think it's the best thing ever, but it's pretty good. Lumber from a piece of sugar maple that has been tapped many times over the years. <gasps> I've always wanted to see the inside of that. That's, that's less dramatic than I was hoping. I thought, like, there'd be gaps and stuff like that, or, like, bits of it would look, like, bleached or almost white. I mean, the grain does sort of look like that, but, but yeah. I made this shirt by hanging it in a window for a year and letting the sun bleach it. That's really cool. How did you keep it aligned? Or did you, like, put a template over it? Oh, wait, the black bit is the temp. Okay, I see. You put tape? That's really cool. I like that. This onion ring looks like the vault symbol from Borderlands. Wasn't, wasn't there a, I swear there was a food-based campaign for Borderlands where they actually did the Archie vault thingy. Still, that looks really good. That's, like, on point. Now I want onion rings, too. <laughs> Met a guy with the same name, same tattoo. Oh, that's fantastic. I love it. This Maltesers chocolate bar that came without any chocolate on it. Okay, that's a crime. The video game at my burger joint was made by Logitech. There's an H at the end, but that's fine. There's a video game at your burger joint? Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Is this like a cat? Oh, it's a top-down cabinet. Oh, that's fascinating. On one hand, I'm like, oh, wow, this could be worth a lot of money. On the other hand, I'm glad it's like still in use and still in a restaurant. My Korean hotel has a window re repelling? Oh, like, oh, like repel, like insects. No, a render repelling hook for escaping during emergencies. That's not a terrible idea. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's uh, at a certain height, you can't use ladders. Like we have window ladders and stuff, but at a certain point, like you're, you're out of height. Like you're going to run out of ladders. So th I mean, that works. The sun beaming down on my bananas. <laughs> Turned them black after about three hours. Fascinating. I don't fruit, but uh, I'm sure somebody else will have an explanation for this one. This dog has to have a special do not approach leash. Yes. Um, I mean, in general, you shouldn't approach a dog that you don't know. Like, dogs with previous abuse exist, and then they get adopted by nicer people, hopefully, that, that then treat them better, and then they rehabilitate them into the world. But, like, that trauma doesn't ever evaporate overnight, overnight, and they still have to go for a walk, so, like, I don't know. A duck bill for your dog! That's hilarious for five seconds and or if the dog is a good sport and is like okay for costumes and stuff like that because some dogs are don't use it for more than five seconds and it's probably not worth the cost for that five seconds the way my knife broke while i was cutting apples <laughs> yeah there's a there's supposed to be more to the blade not just a little tiny dinky just notch into the handle it's it's supposed to go deeper the reason knives have handles that are the length that they are is that the knife is supposed to continue through the handle oh i'm sorry you got gypped by the cheap knife. Today, I went to the United Kingdom's northernmost wood. Just, like, just one piece of wood that is the northernmost wood. The trees look really creepy here. It's like the sun was constantly moving in weird spiral patterns while they're growing. They were like, no, I'm over here. Now I'm over here. Now I'm over here. One of my eyelashes is blonde and twice as long. Uh, yeah, that, uh, that happens. Really fascinating, actually. Uh, it happens when there's something, there's basically a signal to your hair follicle that says, okay, that thing's hair long enough. Stop growing it and fall out. If that signal doesn't get sent correctly, you end up with a hair that just keeps growing. Eventually, it usually breaks off or, you know, falls out, but that follicle is usually, like, damaged or something like that. Two five-leafed clovers I found today. Uh, get your Geiger counter out, just, just to make sure. That isn't based in reality or anything. I just seem like something you'd want to check. Duplicate Lego sets have different number of parts. Yes. Yes, they do. Lego will and has a revised set in the past, uh, typically either for if things aren't clear or if things end up not being as rigid as they want or in different regions. Also, the number of parts you get left over with, like all the little tiny like single and double stud things and accessories, those are all done by weight and they calibrate the scales to be slightly over so that it's always erring on the side of making sure you have all the parts and maybe a few extra instead of under and then they have to send you another part. So the part count is only reflective of the parts needed to build the actual model, not the number of parts that are actually in the box. More stuff you didn't ask for, but you're here, so you're welcome.